Good morning, guys. It's Charlotte. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome to my car decorating vlog. I am so excited to decorate my brand new car. If you guys are new here or you didn't see, I just recently purchased this car. This is a Honda HRV. I bought it like less than a week ago. I filmed earlier, like a little while ago, I filmed my empty car tour and my actually like buying the car vlog. So I will link that in the cards if you haven't seen it. But in today's video, we are decorating this car, personalizing it, making it exactly the way I want it to be. And I'm so, so excited. I've got some stuff already, but I also wanna go out and grab a few more things. Oh my God, it is 100,000 degrees in here, okay. It's 75 degrees outside and I'm wearing a sweatshirt like a dummy. Please bear with me. I'm still figuring out my camera settings. So I know it's like really bright over here and really dark over there. I'm doing the best that I can, but we are going to head out and go grab some stuff for my car. I want to get an air freshener at Yankee Candle. I'll explain why I have to get a Yankee Candle specific one in a bit when we actually decorate the car. And then I also want to go to like TJ Maxx and like Home Goods and see if I can get a little bag and some little like mini products. May also have to swing through Target. <laughs> so that is the plan. We're going to do a quick little shopping spree for the car. And then once we're back, we will come back and decorate the car and personalize it and make it all mine. So welcome to the vlog. Let's get decorating my car. the stores I ended up going to three different stores first I went to Yankee Candle then I went to TJ Maxx and then I also went to Target and I went a little bit ham I got a bunch of stuff that I probably don't need but you know you only get your first car once okay first things first we went to Yankee Candle and I got three little car air fresheners in three different scents. I had to go to Yankee Candle specifically to get like the little hanging ones that hang on your rear view mirror because I've had these ones in the past, these little like Febreze ones that like clip onto your air vent. But because I have like a non-typical air vent, these little like clip on ones won't work. I'm gonna go with a little hanging one because I also have something else that I'm gonna hang for my rear view mirror and I think they'll go really cute together, so. I think it'll be okay. I got first up Sun and Sand. It's this fun little like beachy one and the color is like orange in there. I also got Pink Sand. This one I feel like is really popular. I feel like all the girlies, if you have like a Yankee Candle air freshener, this is the one that the girlies have. And then I also got Clean Cotton is the last one that I got. And I love the smell of like fresh laundry, fresh cotton. Like that is one of my favorite scents ever. It's just like really fresh and subtle. Then I went over to TJ Maxx and I got two things at TJ Maxx. Okay, the first thing I got at TJ Maxx was this cute little bag. This is what I'm going to put like in my center console as like my emergency supplies, kind of like my refresh kit, if you will. So all of the stuff that I got at Target is going to go in here. This will be like extra deodorant like extra like advil and aleve and like headache stuff or like extra feminine products like anything that i'm like oh crap like i wish i had this 
I will have a mini version and I will keep it in here and it's just gonna stay in my car. And then the other thing I got while I was at TJ Maxx, this is gonna go in my little bag. This is a nail like manicure set. I mean, first of all, look at it. It's got plants all over it. You guys know how much I love plants. This has like nail clippers, a nail file, like mini scissors, some tweezers. This is basically like, if anything ever goes wrong with my nails, I will be able to deal with it. And I did, I got quite a lot at Target. I did go ham and cheese at Target. Um, first up, I got this little mini hairbrush. I got a tie to go stick in case I have any like stains on my clothes or anything, or if I get any stains like on the seats in my car and I don't have time to like actually clean them. I got these little mini Clorox wipes. These are just to, like wipe down my car if I need to, if I spill anything again, or it's like looking extra dusty. That's what these are for. I also got hand wipes. If again, I don't really plan on like eating that much in my car, but like if I eat my car, like if I go out to eat and then like get back in the car or for whatever reason, I need to like wipe my hands off. I have these little hand wipes. I also got, I probably went overkill and I probably didn't need both of these things, but I also got a hand sanitizer just in case. How much more did I get? I also got a little mini dry shampoo in case of whatever. I got this mini, this one is really mini. I think I might've gotten scammed on this one. There can't be more than like two squeezes of product in here. A little mini sunscreen, just like specifically for my face. A little mini deodorant just to keep in my car. I, fun fact about me, <laughs> I carry a deodorant with me in every single bag that I own and I have at least three in my bedroom at any given time because I just have this fear of smelling bad. I will forever have this little mini car deodorant that just lives in the car. Okay, and then last thing, finally, I got this little tiny lint roller. I kind of was in Target and I really just saw all these mini things and I'm probably, I'm pretty sure I got a bunch of stuff that I don't need because I was seduced by how cute the little packaging was on all these mini things. So what are the odds that I'm gonna need a lint roller in my car? low, but better to have it and not need it than need it and not have it. Am I right? And then I didn't get, I didn't see any like Aleve or Advil or like pain relief stuff. So I still need to get that. And then I didn't purchase this while I was out today, but I, same way with deodorant, I have chapstick with me everywhere I go. So I have one of these little Aquaphor chapstick sticks um, that I'm going to be putting here in the car as well. And then because I just... I'm incapable of being calm ever in my life. I also ordered a couple of things from Amazon that came in the mail that I wanted to show you guys that are for the car. Okay, so I got four things from Amazon. It's dawning on me in this very moment how much stuff I got, but it's fine because it's the kind of stuff that I only need to buy once and I don't need to like rebuy. So the first thing that I got from Amazon are these little car coasters. Oh, they're so cute. So these go right in your cup holders and they're just supposed to help like keep your cup holders clean. Okay, the next thing I got from Amazon is one of these little like screen cleaners. I keep seeing these all over TikTok and I wanted to get one because I do have like a screen, like a pop-up screen in this car that I really wanna keep clean. I hate when you can like see fingerprints and stuff. And this one's really cute because it comes in a little protective case, but basically you like spray it on your little screen and then it's wrapped in this microfiber so you can just wipe the screen down after. Okay, next I got a mini car trash can. I'm so excited about this one because I hate having trash in my car. So this one is super small. It just fits like right in your cup holder, but it's super cute. It's black obviously, so it matches the car really well, but you just like push the lid in and put your trash right in there. And then when it gets full, pop the lid right off, dump your trash out and put it back. Okay, and then this is the last thing that I purchased new for this car. I have a couple other things that I wanna show you guys that I already had. This is a little like holder for all of your documents in your cars, like your registration, your insurance. You could keep your license in here if you wanted to, but I'll just keep mine like in my wallet like I normally do. But this is just so much like sleeker and cuter, honestly, than like that huge folder documents that they give you when you first get a car. That is everything that I purchased. The last thing that I wanna show you guys is something that I already had, but might be the first thing that goes up in this car. It's a little hanging plant for my rear view mirror, so it's gonna go like roughly 
like here but it's so cute i got this from etsy two years ago i think maybe last year um but i had this in the red car before we sold it and it is just so cute you guys know me you you know i can't go more than 10 feet without needing to add some kind of plant real or fake so it's just right that i have a little hanging macrame plant in my car then i also have some less interesting stuff like i got a beach pass and um this is my easy pass this is so I can go through tolls without having to stop and pay cash. But that is the little car haul. I am sweating my butt off. So I'm going to step outside, get out of this car, and then we will start decorating and putting everything together. And I am so excited to see how it looks. doesn't look that different just when you look at it most of the stuff I'm realizing that I got went straight into here so whoops I do eventually want to get a steering wheel cover for my little steering wheel because it's not very grippy like it's kind of slipping and sliding but there was one that I wanted on Amazon and between the time that I put it in my cart and went to place the order it had gone out of stock so I will eventually order a steering wheel cover, but I had everything else ready and I didn't really want to wait to film this video or honestly to customize my car. Even though you really can't tell all that much, I think the stuff hanging from the rear view really sells it. Name a more Charlotte thing than a candle and a plant hanging from the rear view mirror of my car. You can't. I think even though it's really small, this is such a fun touch. And like, like I said, really speaks to this being my car. Also this scent, Sun and Sands, smells so yummy. I would say that's easily the part that you can see the most that I customized about the car. The part I'm probably proudest of is everything going on in here. You guys kind of already saw it during the montage, but I've got like all my essentials in here. So right now I have the other two car air fresheners that I got. We have my little bag with all of my essentials and then both my sets of wipes are in there the hand wipes and the Clorox wipes and everything just fits in here super nicely which I love and it closes right up the other thing I'm really proud of is my like registration information this little guy obviously I can't show you guys the stuff that's in here because that is all of my like important confidential information <laughs> but trust me it looks cute but with the car all decorated i think that is gonna do it for this like car organization and personalization video there are some things that i still need to get and like a window breaker and like some jumper cables and kind of more like car safety stuff this was definitely just like the aesthetic like decoration stuff so i will be getting those in time but that is gonna be it for right now i'm so excited for all the videos that we're gonna like film in this car and just like have this car be a part of my life and a part of the vlog, obviously. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like on it for me down below and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. But that is it for this one. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. So let us dance this Bye guys.